Today I'm going to show you how to do the still working easy car merge glitch in GTA 5 Online. So the first thing what you're going to want to do is go ahead and set up an invite only session. And once you do, just go ahead and make your way to your bunker. And go ahead and go inside of your bunker. Now once you spawn inside of your bunker, just go ahead and walk out your bunker. And leave it. Once you're outside your bunker, just go ahead and either request a buzzer from your CEO or go ahead and call Lester and locate a helicopter. Either one, just make sure you don't call for a personal vehicle because that will mess up the glitch. So in this escape plan, go ahead and locate a helicopter. And I make my way to my auto shop and my helicopter. So go ahead and make your way to your auto shop with your helicopter. Once you go to your auto shop, just go ahead and park your helicopter and make your way inside of it. Make sure you have inside of your auto shop the car that you want to merge, the car with all the mods or anything. So go ahead and make your way inside of it. Once you're in your auto shop, just go ahead and make your way to the vehicle that you want to transfer the mods on. So go ahead and go inside of it. Go ahead and click modify right on the d-pad and once your car is in the auto shop just go ahead and back out of it so go ahead and go back and confirm it and you should park your car again now once you do that just go ahead and make your way to the snacks bowl Alright now once you're at the snacks bowl, go ahead and go to the front of it, press right on the d-pad to grab some snacks. And once you do that and you see this little menu of snacks, go ahead and join the Anowak. So just go ahead and search up Anowak and go ahead and join one that's online. And once you get all the alerts, just go ahead and accept all of them and decline the last one. Alright now once you accept all those alerts you should see your top left screen your snack screen should be glitched and it should be there so go ahead and make your way next to the car that's parked here go ahead and go right next to the door and what you're going to want to do is go ahead and join the anowak and accept all three of the alerts again you should get the getting gt online session details you should get the alerts go ahead and accept all of them and if you can decline the last one if you can't just go ahead and accept it it should put you back at the game like I did so. You should get a black screen. If you do get a black screen, just go ahead and join the Anowak one more time. And when you do spawn in, you should see that your car should be merged. All the mods should be on it. So as you can see, I now have all the mods on this car. And that's how you merge cars in GTA 5 Online. If this video helped you in any way, make sure you guys like and subscribe and comment down below any questions you have.